I start my wipe method and within three days, whatever I gained on vacation is gone. When I come from vacation, I feel so icky and I feel bloated and I feel ugh, and I feel weighed down and I'm just like, I need to get back on a vacation. What up girl? I'm fresh off my flight from New York. I just went to New York and had all the things. I needed this break so bad. Now I'm back home and I want to introduce you to my method called wipe. I have recently lost, well not recently, I always say recently because it it was literally in 2020 I lost over 100 pounds and I've been able to keep it off for almost four years now with what I call the wipe method and I'm going to share that with you. But yes, I went to New York, I had all the things, I had French toast, pizza, ice cream, I had a great time and when I go on vacation, I get, I get right back on it. I come home, I start my fast, I start my wipe method and within three days, whatever I gained on vacation is gone. When I come from vacation, I feel so icky and I feel bloated and I feel ugh, and I feel weighed down and I'm just like, I need to get back on it. Vacation is for fun. When you get back home, it is a must. An absolute must for me at least it is a must to get back on it because as quick as I lost this weight is as quick as the weight can come back so I have to incorporate what I did to lose the weight and that includes the wipe method the wipe method is the way I've been able to keep my weight off so we're gonna get into it if you see this as valuable to you share it with your friends try it for yourself it works it's helped me and it's very simple y'all so number one or should I say number W walk I got in my three miles already since I've gotten back home actually at the airport I that's the sound of my actually at the airport so as you can see I got in my miles so far today is that today no that's not today that's just today so as you can see I got in my miles 2.4 miles so far today 6,000 steps so I have about, about a mile less than a mile left to go the W in the word wipe stands for walk three miles is all I'm doing for the next three days if I get in more great but when I get back home I have a lot of work to do so I can't really get focused into working out so three miles each day for the three days the I in wipe stands for in and out burger I go on a keto diet so to speak so I order this meal called flying Dutchman from in and out burger I get two orders of those which is the burger patty and the cheese and I eat that for three days for lunch and for dinner I have done this for seven days where all I had was in and out burger for lunch and for dinner and I lost 18 pounds in seven days include using the wipe method but we're only going to do this for three days because i only got a few pounds to lose i didn't gain too much so in and out burger flying dutchman i get that for lunch and for dinner two orders of those which is four burger patties you don't gain any weight i'm telling you if you are a keto diet fan you know about the flying dutchman the p in wipe stands for pomegranates the pomegranates is full of fiber. I love pomegranate seeds so much. As a matter of fact, I, I need to eat my pomegranate seeds. They're so good. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. The burst of fruit. I eat them cold. They're so good for you. So, so good. Pomegranate seeds with the wipe method moves the stool, moves all that food that I ate the past four days and gets it out of me ASAP. The E in the wipe method stands for evaporation. Evaporation is the process of liquid water changing into water vapor or gas through the process of energy. In order for this to happen, you have to have heat. You have to have a temperature change and you have to combine water. So the white method works to lose that weight you gain if you combine it with water and some form of energy and heat. What produces the heat? You walking or me walking. What produces the energy? 
the water that we drink is not just about drinking water it is about the water that we drink dissolving the things in our bodies that are bad for the body or the overeating we do or the extra salt that we eat the water causes those things to break down and to be released from the body quicker than if you weren't drinking water so if you eat a lot of salt I don't want to say eat a lot of salt because you can have a lot of water but if you eat a lot of salt and you drink water you do you break that water down so much quicker if you weren't a water drinker so evaporation in the body is is needed and water is needed for that to happen and that just gets all of that that solid bad stuff out of you so much quicker so you need water to produce evaporation and you need the heat to produce the evaporation also it's just it's more than just you need to drink water could you tell people drink more water and they're like okay but they don't get it if you're trying to lose weight or better your health your body needs the evaporation from the water. What does evaporation do? It turns the food into gas. It gets the food out of you. It moves the food through the body. Let's say you eat a lot of salt. You know, and I'm not one to say eat a lot of salt, but in case you have way too many ramen noodles, if you drink a little more water than normal, it produces the evaporation and it breaks down that salt in your body. But evaporation needs heat. Where does the heat come from? From walking and getting the energy moving in your body that produces the heat, that produces the evaporation, but you need the water in order for everything to work effectively. All of these key methods work together in order to make the wipe method more effective. Walking, the protein from the In-N-Out Flying Dutchman Burger, the pomegranate, which moves moves the food through you that you had you ate on vacation and went a little crazy. Those pomegranates not only are they good and juicy, juicy. Not only are they good and juicy, but they're so good for you that fiber is needed to move the food along. And then you got the evaporation, working with the heat, working with the water, working with breaking the foods down in your body. So within three days, you've lost six to ten pounds of the weight you gain. The wipe method is how I've been able to keep off over 100 pounds in almost four years. And it's so simple, it is so easy. You don't have to do a lot. Sis, alkaline water, I'm almost done with it. This is my gallon of water, so I can drink from it, right? Oh, that is, that is so good. That is so good, mm, mm. I have to drink my water. I do drink temperature, room temperature water, but I just came off the plane, sis. I am hot, I am sweaty. And so alkaline water, I try to do a gallon, if you can, slowly, because water poisoning is similar to alcohol poisoning. Got my pomegranate, literally ran in the store and got the last two, because they don't last long. Mm, mm, mm. So, you need water. Because if you're trying to lose weight, sis, your body needs that evaporation. It needs that heat from the energy release from walking. In order for all of this to work together, you need to walk. You need the In-N-Out burger or whatever protein of your choice. Pomegranates and evaporation, which is the water to produce the energy and the evaporation and get the heat going so your body can reduce all that weight and you can feel better uh, uh. okay so hopefully the white method works for you because it has worked for me and i love it love it love it love it love it, love it. all right y'all i'll see you in another video mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm.